We are starting off with breakfast today. So I have toasted bread, um, two eggs, kind of scrambled dish with some tomato. I usually don't eat eggs, but occasionally here and there I will. I put onion, salt as seasoning, and then crushed red pepper. I also have a bag of blackberries. All right, so for today, we're going to head to the cosmetics company store. Um, we're going to go to Elizabeth, New Jersey from Brooklyn. It is, I think, an hour-ish away. It does say here that they open up at 11, but we're doing good timing because it is only 1024. Um, the cosmetics company store has a bunch of high-end makeup at the current moment on sale for $10 each. So you can get goods from like Tom Ford, um, Too Faced, Estee Lauder. It is owned by Estee Lauder like the whole store i think it's just a way for brands to get rid of their goods but now more than ever they're having like the biggest sale ever so it's gonna be my first time going to the store we'll see what the vibe is like but yeah let's head out let's get gas and let's do this okay so here it's gonna take us 55 minutes to get there i thought this was really cool so i had to show you guys so we're in new york of course i'm in brooklyn we got manhattan there we're gonna cross the ocean and make our way to elizabeth new jersey <laughs> Okay, so for now we're actually approaching Canal Street, which is on the way to uh, the, what's that called? Holland Tunnel? <laughs> okay. We're just gonna drive in silence. <laughs> Yeah, I actually never really drive here. I think this is maybe like the second or third time in my life that I drove here. It's very squishy for sure. You have to be very, very careful. Alrighty, let's go. Okay, so I'm just looking at this. It was really hard to find it because I was looking for a cosmetics company store, but it's actually from the word the cosmetics company store. All right, B. That is so cool. They have a Martels here as well. We're gonna totally hit, hit that up. And then I see down here they actually have a Burlington, which I usually don't go to, but here is the store. But I don't know what this means. Like, this doesn't help me. Just give me the store. Okay, so here we are. Um, it was actually really easy to find. Let's see what the vibe is like. Yeah, so they're basically having this summer savings event, all makeup, six for 60 bucks. Let's see what we could find. I'm so excited. So firstly, they have some of these Peach Perfect um, high coverage concealers by Too Faced. Everything in the store is six for 60. So essentially everything is like 10 bucks, but you can only choose one from each brand. So really cool. I remember when this came out, it wasn't that popular, so I'm assuming that's why it's on sale sale. We also have a lot of other Too Faced goodies. We have the bronzer, Born This Way Loose Powder, these Sweetheart Blushes, Liquid Lipsticks, Peach Mist, Hangover RX Primer, the Peach Mist. Yeah, more of those, more lip products, and more of these goods. They also have some of their lashes here as well. They actually look pretty good. And then we have the Pineapple Glow. Uh, face mask. We've seen tons of these goodies at TJ Maxx and Marshalls. Um, we haven't seen these though. These are beautiful. They also have the Diamond Light um, Fire Highlighters here as well. And then they have the Multi-Use Complexion Powder in various different colors. And then some of the Love Light Highlighters as well. These are fairly new so it's really exciting to see it here. It's the Peach Bloom infused with mm, honey lip product. And here is what the little one looks like. I have a tester out. Originally 25, you can use it for the lips or cheeks. Then they also have these chocolate matte eyeshadows. I remember when these came out as well. I, th I think that they thought it would do better, but it really wasn't that hyped. They have, unfortunately, because they are really cute, five different shades, and the shade of the box indicates the shade of the eyeshadow. So here we have the shade chocolate wine. This one right here is in the shade amaretto. It's like the nudish, nudist one of the bunch. The name of this one is the cutest. It's called Warm and Fudgy. How adorable. This one right here is called Tiramisu. I would say it's the most mauve toned gray purple one. I actually found some more of these. This one right here is, what's it called? Cocoa Cream. It's like a white yellow. So this one right here is called Chocolate Bunny. This one right here is called Chocolate Malt. Similar to Tiramisu, I think this one may be a little bit darker but similar like it's in the same family and then this one right here is called chocolate chai i would say this is the most orangey of the bunch 
I also spotted one of the Too Faced Lip Injection Extreme in Cinnamon Bear, which is one of their newer glosses. So cool to see this here. I don't love these from them, but it's still awesome to find it. They also have tons of these um, like eyeliners here in various different colors. So we have like this one. These are their killer liners. I think this is a white one. How cool. Okay, so here are all the shades we have for the killer liners. We have Killer Cashmere, Camo, Chocolate, Caramel, Gingerbread, Espresso. Ooh, then they have these Peach Bloom Lip Balms. So the other item that we saw initially was like for lips and cheeks. This is just a lip balm. And here are the shades that we're working with. So cute. We also have this brush kit um, on sale as well. It comes with the five brushes and then a makeup bag. They also have the Born This Way uh, multi-use concealer. I've never tried this, but I heard it was amazing. Then they also have this kit here as well, which comes with the makeup bag, a mist, the primer, and then the gloss. And then they also have the Born This Way matte foundation, which I never got into, but they have these on sale as well. They also have a bunch of these MAC uh, Fix Pluses here on sale too. Most of this is like scents. As well as tons of single MAC shadows. We usually see these a lot at TJ and Marshalls, but they have... I would say a bigger selection here if you're looking for any specific shade. They have a lot to choose from. They also have these um, lip mix um, products as well. You can kind of mix these lip products to create your own customized shade. We've been finding this collection at Marshalls and TJ Maxx, but they have a lot more here and a few other kits. Okay, and then also with these kits as well, we saw a few of these at TJ and Marshalls, but they have even more here. Um, and it's much neater, of course. They also have this pre-made face palette here. And then they have this one as well. They have tons of lashes to choose from, from various different collections. I will say though, their lashes are not like OMG vibes. So I don't know if they're necessarily worth it, but they're here if you were looking out for them. They also have this MAC kit here as well. We basically get a palette with six full shadows, um, a mascara, and then a liner. All of these are full sizes. They also have this MAC kit here as well. Um, here we get three full-size lip products, a liner, gloss, and lipstick. Okay, and then just for example, here is one of the holiday kits. So in this specifically, we get a really cute bag and then three deluxe-sized glosses, all like nudish type of colors. And then we have this really pretty pink kit. This kit has a pink pouch with three glosses, one red, more like peachy tone, and one white, like iridescent one. Here that they also have a bunch of these Bobbi Brown brushes for 75% off. I don't know what the original value is, but these have to be like less than $10 each for sure. This right here is the cutest little one ever. I didn't even know that they had this here. How adorable. It's the Too Faced Clover little pup. Love you little guy. So Tom Ford is actually also part of these 6 for 60. They have these glow tinted moisturizers here. How awesome. And originally they're like 70 bucks. So if you want Tom Ford, here's where it's at. They also have the Flawless Glow Foundation here as well. So if you guys are curious about this one, they have it here. Um, Six for 60, but you can only choose one from like per brand, but I still think it's really cool to have this as an option How awesome is this? They also have these Tom Ford um, Skin illuminators for face and body so they have this shade right over here the deeper bronze Which is called bronze glow and then we have this one which is called guilt glow They also have some of the Tom Ford nail polishes here if you guys were interested, but they don't have any testers out so I don't know what the shades look like. I'm assuming gorgeous though. This right here is also an option. It's the Face Duo. We get a highlighter and then I want to say maybe like a bronzer, but they both seem like they have like a luminous finish. Next, they have these Tom Ford Shade and Illuminate foundations here. I love the packaging. Originally 150. Oh my goodness. So cool that it's part of the sale. Next, they have these Tom Ford Emotion Proof Concealers here and these originally were 54 bucks. They have a few shades here. In regards to eyeshadow quads, these are also, fortunately, which I'm so excited about, are part of the 6 for 60. So we have this one right here. This one specifically is called Daydream. It's definitely more like a cool tone, purpley blue palette. Really nice. And then we have this one right here, which is more neutral slash cooler in tone. I think, I believe it's called Super Novi. This is so beautiful. It's called Bad AFF. It's so pretty. I love the glittery, like purpley black one. And the tones are just so perfect for like full winter. Okay, then they also have these Tom Ford concealer pens here, so originally 55, but they are also part of the 6 for 60. Next, we're in the Smashbox section. They have this Cover Shot Desert Eyeshadow Palette, also part of the sale. Here is what this one looks like. Let's zoom ya. It's a nice neutral. It's like a neutral gold. And I think that like those blue shades would be so pretty in the lower lash line. And then they also have the um, Denim Palette as well. 
This is one we've never seen at TJ or Marshalls, but it's like more of a bluer palette with pops of neutrals. These have actually been on sale on Ulta site for a really long time now, so I'm actually not surprised to see this here. It's the Halo Glow Highlighter Duo. I would say if you have a medium to deep skin tone, this should work out well, but if you have a fair to light skin tone, it's probably going to be a bit too dark. They also have this kit right here, which is part of the sale. You get three palettes, I think one face palette and then two eyeshadows, something like that. They also have this liquid lip kit here from Smashbox, five deluxe sizes. Then they have these kits as well, which you've actually seen at TJ, I want to say, but they have them here now. And then this one as well, which includes glosses, mainly, yeah. They also have this Smashbox O Gloss here, which is actually pretty good. And then they pretty much have every single Smashbox brush ever, I want to say. So some face brushes, some eye brushes. These are good quality brushes, I will say. Ten out of ten. They also have these MAC palettes here, which aren't part of the 6 for 60 but she says it kind of comes out cheaper. So this is 1180 This was part of their holiday collection. Here's one of the testers. So here what the shades look like on the inside. They also have the Diamond Light Highlighter here from Too Faced as well for $9. And here's what this one looks like. It was an interesting highlighter. It was kind of interesting. It was like blue, green, white, pink, purple. Very unpredictable in a way. They also have this Bumble and Bumble kit here. 20, it says 20 bucks, but I believe it's on sale for 10. They also have these um, High Shine Sparkling Lip Glosses by Too Faced for 550. We have yet to find these at TJ or Marshalls. They were both in the same shade, which is pretty penny stunning. They also have these Clinique Stay Matte Oil Free Foundations here as well that you can choose from. Love the packaging. If you have oily skin, I think this might be great. They also have these Clinique, what are these called exactly? Perfectly Real Compact Makeup. So here is what the actual product looks like so it's just a powder this is pretty cool they also have the even better refresh hydrating uh, foundations here so if you have dry skin just like me this might be nice and then they also have the beyond perfecting foundation here too if you guys were wanting this also they do have the even better makeup uh, foundation here as well so tons of shades to choose from then we have even more right over here and then they also have the Clinique Super Balanced Silk Makeup with SPF 15. And these are the only shades that I see here at my store. So <clears throat> only the lighter shades I see. This is pretty cute. They have this Clinique 3 Eye and Cheek Palettes little kit. So it comes with this palette. We get four shadows and a blush. Then it comes with this one. Also four shadows and a blush but different tones. And then it comes with the purpley one as well. So cool, I found one of the MAC Extra Dimension blushes here from one of their newer collections. This is in Dilly Dolly, part of the 6 for 60. This right here is a tester, but they have some of these shadows um, available as well. This is in Monaco. They have a decent amount here. They also have this palette here as well, which is part of the 6 for 60. The other one we saw is not part of it, so I guess depending on, you know, What's what? We'll find stuff that are part of the sale and part of not, but everything here is still very cheap. This palette right here is called Natural. It's so pretty. It includes a nice amount of berry tones and then browns. They also have this MAC collection here as well, which I didn't even know existed, but they have a few of these here now. This is basically the tester and it includes three lip products that you can mix and match with. They also have a few of these that we saw at TJ and Marshalls recently. Basically, it includes um, two highlighters and one blush. This is the Medium Deep Trio. They actually also have the That's My Jam Too Faced palette here, but I'm not going to open it because it's actually someone should let me film. But I'll throw up a pic of what this looks like. I cannot believe it's here because it just came out like less than six months ago. Oh, and by the way, Little Clover is $14 and I believe 22 cents is what she said. They also have these single shadows here from Holiday 2020, I want to say. How beautiful are these little ones? We have this one right here, which is called Firework the Room. This right here is called Cooler Than Being Cool. Next up, we got this beautiful pink, which is called Explosive Chemistry. The name's on these, let me tell ya. And this one right here is called Silver Bells. They also have this highlighter here, which is called Flare for the Dramatic. And it's a really pretty deep, deep gold. Love the embossment. They actually also have some of these um, cheek pop blushes. This right here is Nude Pop. This right here is called Plum Pop. Oh my gosh, one of my favorite songs is on now. This right here is called Cola Pop. Looks like it's dirty. Mm -mm. Then we got Ginger Pop. And originally these are $26. Dolos. Now you've got a higher power. They also have this Estee Loader kit here for 75 bucks. You get a ton of goodies. I think some palettes, some face palettes, eye palettes basically. The products, eye makeup remover, and mascara skincare up there and it comes in this really pretty like velour suitcase pouch situation it's really gorgeous 
They also have some goods here from Origin. So we have some of their blushes originally 27, but it's part of the six for 60. And then they also have the Pretty in Bloom SPF 20 flower infused foundations here as well. They also have these kits here, so a skincare kit. We have this lipstick kit here. This looks like a good deal. Looks like great shades too. We got this, one lipstick and a little pouch. And then the same items here. This is ginger souffle body cream. Yum, looks good. They also have the Razzle Dazzle Berry Palette here by Too Faced. Actually, they just put these out. This Glam Glow Super Mattifying uh, Clarifying Primer. Super light, smooth and blur primer here. From Smashbox as we saw before. And then this really awesome Bobbi Brown um, Autumn Avenue Eyeshadow Palette. Which basically looks like this right over here. Kind of pretty. So it would typically be 127.33. You can do it, yeah. <laughs> But it's 61.98, so six for 60. Thanks for waiting. Okay, so that's pretty much it. You got this free like cute tote um, when you purchase a few things. But yeah, we're headed home now. I'll show you guys what I got when I get there. Okay, so here's pretty much what I ended up picking up. So firstly, I picked up the Smashbox Studio Skin Full Coverage uh, Foundation. I got it in the shade 1.1 Fair Light with neutral undertones. I definitely think this shade is gonna work out for me. We'll see, I'll test it out and keep you posted. Next, I picked up this beautiful Bobbi Brown blush in the shade Clementine. These tones are everything to me. Such a beautiful, perfect, um, just orangey coral type of pink. So pretty. Okay, then I picked up the Born This Way Super Coverage Multi-Use Sculpting con Concealer. I have the hiccups. So this is in the shade Spice Rum. So of course, this is going to be way too dark for me, but I picked it up so that I can cream contour with it. And here you guys can see what the shade looks like. I think it should be a good color. I'll definitely use like a little though, because I feel like even that swatch is too much. But looks good so far. Next, I picked up this MAC Extra Dimension Blush in Dilly Dolly. I love the compact. This color is really, really pretty. It was the last one there, so I took it as a sign. Here you guys can see, it's a really pretty, like, light uh, pinky. I would say even, like, highlighter blush, you know what I mean? Next, I picked up this beautiful Clinique blush in Ginger Pop. And here you guys can see what it looks like. I would say pretty different compared to the Bobbi Brown. The Bobbi Brown is more pink. The Clinique is more peachy. I love those tones. I think it's perfect. And that was with a one swipe swatch. And then this is the last item I picked up. This Tom Ford Quad in Bad AFF. Um, I love it. It's just, it was actually my first Tom Ford Quad ever. How awesome. So gorgeous. These are with one swipe swatches each. They really, really feel like um, silk, let me tell you. And I love these tones. Perfect. Okay, so that is pretty much it. I'm going to put these goods away. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Let me know if you're going to pick up anything from the store. Keep me posted. Looking forward to reading your comments, and I'll see you guys in my next one.